guy, uh, well versed in the matchup, plays uh, Q Puff and BVB yep. a lot. I've played him For a sure. ton of times. Um, he kind of goes through phases of how he wants to approach it. Sometimes he goes aggressive. Sometimes he, you know, platform camps. Sometimes he ledge camps. Does different things. He's um, he's people call him the Godfather of camping. So, <laughs> so he's definitely versed in that. But we're right yep. into it. Starting and up real quick. These up airs are huge because, oh, good stuff. What? The down air chain grab, dude. I went to wobble. That's amazing. Down throw, down air working. You have to, as Jigglypuff, you have to di down and SDI down oh, in order it. to get grabbed after a down throw yeah. down air. That Super was impressive. Just, that was amazing. It's clean up the stock to zero amazing to death. Amazing death DI by Dude <laughs> And even though Wobble was dropped, um, gets another he chance. Cleaned up, yeah, real quick. Um, I'm hoping that Damp doesn't go through that down, go for that down throw down air too much more because it's definitely not a thing yeah, that no. works under any reasonable circumstances. He might do it for the people, but for the people, for the people. Yeah, of I mean like. <laughs> <coughs> okay, so what's What's really big about this matchup is that ice climbers need to demonstrate. Oh, that was. A oh, wobble. all right. So he did try to go for it again. Yeah, for the for the people. Yeah, for the people. One. <laughs> Give him one more. So there's a wobble. Um, wobble. We'll see if he drops it. His tempo's a little fast. Yep. But That's gets good. out of it, and that was actually kind of lucky. Yeah, it was that the saying. down throw I wasn't expecting uh, timing. It, I don't think. Yeah. Yeah, it was a little off. Woo. <laughs> nah, that might be a All right, so that that is a no, dead no. nana. Um, but smash. good for him to get that charge forward uh -huh. smash. You always want to get the biggest punish you can. Uh, when your opponent takes a guaranteed kill off your back of climber. Yep. So basically, um, ice climbers need to demonstrate that they control the ground and that you can't come see, like, dude, Sai is coming with these low um, aerials, these low back airs. Yep. If you can punish him for doing that and force him to start going Good in grab. the air against yep. you, then you start getting those up air pokes. Um, and I think that's where a lot of the reads of the matchup come into play. Um, but Damp doing a great job of staying alive with the solo climber. Um, Reckon as much damage you can. Forward. Yeah, even though he's not getting a lot of damage out of it, he's giving himself opportunities. Yeah. And the opportunities also allow you to get uh, reads on your opponent. You learn how they're going to play against certain ways you would like to play against. It's basically, time's super important. Yeah, exactly. Especially when you're playing ice climbers. Yeah. And in this matchup, which is a very campy one, they're yep. already more than two minutes down. And uh, Damp hasn't lost his first stock. So he's on good time yeah. in case of timeout situation arises. Ooh. Good DI, we're living here. And that ice block. Controversial ice block. Well, you oh. know, it's, I like the ice block. Jigglypuff did, wouldn't have a chance to go hit yep. him. It does give you the little boost, so you're not exactly just falling <laughs> to your death afterwards. Um, Ooh, there goes the. All right, this should be. I oh know, that's not going to be it. Yeah, it's no. a good punish. Best, pun can get. best punish he yep. can get out of it. If Dude Sai was maybe 10% higher, nice down smash. Really good conversion. Uh, Dude Sai had teched in or rolled in uh, twice after Miss Techs. Great Solid down smash. Wow. He's really putting in work here. Down smash is so good. <laughs> <laughs> I love that move. Oh, I wanted a short hop back air. Accidentally got the full hop. Um, good choice for a punish. No DI in that forward smash. Won't Not at all. Make it back to the edge. Nope. Um, we clean it up quick with the double climbers, but oh, and this right, is a this wobble opportunity. It. But yep. if Dudu Sai is mashing well oh, enough, yeah, he can get out. Wobble, yep. So what you need to do is you need to do a desync charge down smash, and you it's let grabbed. go. You let go of the down smash at the same time as you press Z, and then the down smash will hit them, and you'll grab right afterwards. And then you go straight into a wobble. It's like the famous wobbles moment where he's uh, he does the forward smash and then immediately grabs, and everyone's like, oh, yep. yeah, there and, we then, go. and then the down throw up exactly. smash against uh, Hungry Box yep. at uh, Forte Two. Good times. Hopefully we'll see more good stuff out of him at uh, Forte 3. I really hope so. he'll go. All right. Patience, I guess. Ooh. All right, oh, and then wow. the backup get back on. That's Dude, I should have done a get-up attack. If you, if you have the backup climber, like you're edge, you're edge hogging them, um, but they're out of tumble, so the main climber could do an up B and save them. If you do a get-up attack, you're edge hogging them still, but then you also hit the main climber, so it prevents yeah. them from doing up B. Um, instead, he just jumped off the ledge, and it allowed them to get back. Yep. And that should be an easy end to this stock for Dude Sai. Yeah, Dude Sai doing a really good job of. Uh, but this is really good DI. Bringing it all um, back, yeah. There it goes. Because even though it's still three minutes and forty-three seconds, mm -hmm. the clock can become a factor. Of course. And um, having this fifty-five percent lead, all that time helps. Oh, there rolled it is. right into it. Good job. It. More of a, more of a little bit of a, a flub on Dude Sai's part. But yeah. Uh, oh, but oh, he drops the wobble. Oh, damn. Oh, okay. Now he, he needs to not get antsy and like look for these down smashes. Yep. It's what you do when you're uh, 
on a level where you're like, oh man, I really need this to get you get in. Okay, that was good stuff. Right. Yeah, when, when, just, when you no. when you drop a combo that will end in a guaranteed stock, it's super important to accept that you're just back in neutral and it's a fresh situation. Yep. You often have the feeling of like, oh my gosh, I just dropped this combo, what am I gonna do? Hopefully you can get yourself back in the situation you're just in. Exactly, uh, yeah. Clean everything up. Yeah, perfect. So you don't want to be fishing for these. All right, here. Oh, oh shoot. Here we are on uh, Not Bounty. Not going to get <laughs> any punish out of it. Um, Bounty of Creams. Oh. <laughs> surprise, surprise that Judas. I didn't go for a grab there. Yeah. Um, but, yeah, that was crazy. The the rest only hit Nana, and then the hitbox was extended mm -hmm. um, to Popo because wow, of that. Nana. Hardest read. That team stuff. I'm trying to get him in there with the uh, spot dodge. Not always the best option, but ooh. tricky recovery. Good job in a down smash too. All right. Oh, okay, went for, for, went for a little bit of stuff. Probably would have just gone straight for a down smash there. Um, would have had the opportunity to kill with bad DI. That's gonna be it for stock number uno. Yeah, and he, he did that recovery twice in a row, so yep. I think Dude decided was ready for it. Oh. He'll Can be able to get the quick? stock out of this. There he goes. It was looking a little funny in the first. Second of that, but I think we're good. Yeah, there we go. Ooh. It was a little early percent to end it. The thing with uh, <laughs> Icy's Jigglypuff is that anything goes, right? There's rest, <laughs> there's wobbles. It's like right. nothing, there's nobody's one. ever in the clear lead. Or oh, but like the, yeah, the tempo's just too fast. Yep. 200 beats per minute. Uh, there's, a, there's a little bit of room to waver. More room to waver on the lower side than the higher side. You can go as low as 168 yep. uh, with the forward tilt, and you can go as high as 227 with the forward tilt, but it gets very difficult. You have to be like pretty much frame perfect with your consistency. Oh, that's too bad. That's huge. What a shame. We take those. We don't <laughs> even feel bad about it. Not even, Words dude. of OTG. <laughs> What'd you do to learn how to wobble? Did you listen to music? Um, I used a metronome. Oh, okay, actually, sweet. I have an app on my phone. Um, most metronomes, you can. there's a function called tap where you just tap it at a tempo, uh -huh. and the metronome will tell you what tempo you are tapping oh, at. Oh, that's interesting. And so first I would put it to 200 and like listen to it and like think about it. And, and like kind of customize it to how you and then, go and about then it. And then eventually I would start using the tap function. All right. That's and the tap function would tell me how my how my tempo is. Awesome. Oh, it would have been great for him to read that roll. And, uh, Into nothing, though. So oh, he wanted, he wanted the... Uh, there okay, we go. There. That's oh. oh. But yeah, boy. he just pressed forward a little bit yeah. too quickly. Got that forward smash. I'm um, often victim to fast fingers. Yeah, so, okay, it's really important for Damp to keep his composure right now because oh. he, he just had a lot of opportunities to get a wobble and didn't get any of them. So you want to make sure that you're not freaking out. Yeah, for sure. At this point, it's like uh, Dude Side has lost so much on his own free will, kind of, that um, it'd be a shame for Damp kind of not to capitalize on how much he's been given. And there it is. Oh. Oh, man. All right, that was interesting. I don't know how useful it's gonna be to get Juke up off stage. Yeah. Do that. All right. I oh. mean, he was going for the handoff, hoping he could maybe yeah. get a forward throw um, from Nana. Let's see what we can get here. Um, oh, ah, this might be it. Oh, all right. The reverse. Gets the reverse hitbox there, so he's living. He's putting himself in pretty perilous situations. Oh. Mm, interesting, he didn't go for forward throw. Good patience. He's looking uh, for opportunities to weave in, of course. Much yeah. as you can. This might be it though. Yeah, I didn't have his jump. <laughs> Alright, game three. Alright, so game three. Now, the, the worrisome thing about that is that it was a close match, but Dude Tsai had two really weird SDs. Yeah. One was the air dodge off stage on the left side, and one was the rollout off stage mm -hmm. on the right. So, hopefully, Damp has make, made some adjustments. He kind of went into that game quickly. So, either he really knows what he wants to do, yep. or he hasn't figured it out and is hoping to that the stage will help him come up with a different idea. He did get hit by those, oh gosh. I was oh. oh, no, 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 he shouldn't have done that. His backup was alive. You think he could uh, up air, or up special? Yeah, 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 because, back? yeah, he didn't, if he didn't use his uh, double jump, because uh, he DI'd much higher than yeah. his Nana. So he could have not used his double jump and then didn't up B Damn. to save them. Uh, it's hard to know though. You usually just assume that they, they're dead. Yeah. Especially when they're off screen. Can't see much, I get it. Oof. Yeah, this is a, this is half of Ice Climbers. <laughs> All right, we're getting some damage on him. Now he he has to he has to know that when he comes back, um, 
due to size, looking for those aerial rests. He's either going to yep. rest him raw out of the air like he did there, or do the, the down air into rest. For sure. So he's got to like wave dash back a little more, bait out some of those approaches, and see if he can catch him flubbing. Yep. Also, wave dash into shield, like wave dash into light shield is really good. Um, Jigglypuff can't do much about that, um, especially if they're trying to like hit you All right. or rest. Maybe they'll go for a grab, but then of course if they go for a grab, you're already shielding, so then you can just hard shield yeah. and then uh, buffer shield grab as soon as they throw. Beautiful. All right, now there's a bunch of these. Yeah. Point one C. Yeah, right. But Damp's getting some good percent in, so yep. that's okay. Although he doesn't want to get block hit stuff. Here. Yeah, no, that's... All right, now he's going to oh, try to converge. The smoke's kind of annoying. Nice. Good back good air. Good back air. Barely protects himself from getting hit there. All right. If Puff's doing that, ice blocks. Yes. Yep. Because you're going to get... If any character's doing that, you mostly want to... Pretty much, yep. yeah. Trying to be funny about it. Exactly. So just you're just racking on free damage. Yeah, basically. exactly. You just be patient about it. They're gonna, they're gonna get tired of it eventually. Yep. He can't time you out at this rate. The king of know? camp. Because eventually <laughs> the ice block will freeze him. You know, and at high enough percent, it's gonna freeze him off the top. Lucy just tuning again. Melee is a fun game. Oh uh, yeah, Damp needs to not be approaching like that. He really just needs to keep doing ice blocks. Ah, uh, see, because he, he's he's going for these hits. Yeah, he's he's just not going to get them. I think I don't know if he's sped up or if he's, and soon enough, he's like at the soon percent. Enough, I could, Dude, could come yeah. up with like an invincible pound. Maybe he thinks he can hit like a rogue down smash. Ooh, he's back. Does he have to play on the stage? All right. Ooh. Oh my. Oh no. Uh, that's all right. Oh no. That's too bad. All right. Th same thing. Yeah, because see, that's the thing is that if he had just kept doing ice blocks, Dude Sai would have had a lot of damage on him and, and would have gotten frustrated yeah. and come at him. And once Jigglypuff's like over 100%, if you just, like I said at the beginning, if you really cover the ground and make sure they can't come in with low approaches, yeah. he has to jump over you. Like there, you can up air him. Up, yeah, up air, up smash even. But instead, but instead, he got into a situation where he gave Dude Sai enough openings to start fighting him on the ground, and then Dude Sai was able to make a stock out of it. Alright, we'll cover this right now, back on stage. Alright, ooh. Spacing's a little funny. Yeah. Yeah, he's just getting there too close go. to the edge. Alright, good yep. down smash. Okay, he's gotta be careful. Light shield and wave dash into light shield. I like the movement. That's the key. Taking his time. Looking for a roll. Classic Doesn't get inside. it. Oh, that shield. Right, they have their jump. Oh, oh that was yeah. kind of perfect. In case that happens, you want to always do your up B at the ledge. Yep. Try to so hit him with the uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So that you just grab the ledge even if it doesn't work. That's what you're saying. Try to hit with the down tilt there. Uh, how how often do you see down tilt on ice numbers? What situations? Yeah, it's it's mostly just for wobbling. Yeah. <laughs> um, I get that. You can use it in edge guarding, but it's sort of a cheeky thing mm -hmm. because if you were going to hit him with a down tilt, you can also just grab ledge yeah. and then just. Get up and hit them. Or anything else. Down smash. Um, that, cool. But yeah, especially against Puff because he's going to pop them up and not really put them in any situation to do anything. But yeah, see, all this happened, and I'm worried that he's just lost his will to fight. Yeah, at this point, he's, 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 not, uh, he's not leaning forward as much. Yeah, he's, uh, he's got, he got a little flustered toward the end for sure. Yeah, and really, all of that just came from go going to the edge when Julie Puff mm -hmm. was planking. You just, if you just keep kept ice blocks, ice blocks. Yeah, yeah, exactly. As boring as it feels, like you just keep doing that and you'll be in a good situation. All right, take over for me. Listen, Disco Boogie, Disco Boogie signing out. It's been a pleasure, my good friend. Good commentating with Hope you. Hope to see you some more. All right. What a nice guy. I'm going to learn a lot.